Hey guys, so welcome back. If you all are new here, welcome to the channel. Today I have a huge Ulta haul. I went inside of Ulta and picked up a few items and I also ordered a few items online. So let's just jump right into the haul. Y'all, excuse my nails, like my press-ons is not pressing on no more, okay? <laughs> they ain't popping off. I had them on for like two weeks. So excuse my nails, excuse my hand. I'm just all messed up. I'll show you guys to what I got from Ulta online. I purchased a few things online. I'll start off with this tree hut scrub. I told myself that I wasn't going to buy any more tree hut scrubs, okay? Because I have a lot. So like, I don't have a lot as some people, but I have enough. How often do you guys exfoliate? Because I hear some people do it like three times a week, and I'm like, you're lucky if I do it once. <laughs> but um i do do it but i don't i i don't do it three times a week i had to get this one you guys this one is new and i'm like okay this is new i've never seen this one so let's see what it smells like honey the color is um giving me like summer vibes that's why i picked it up oh it does smell like rainbow sherbet ice cream this smells like a it smells like some sort of slushy. Will I pick this up again? No. This is something that I just see myself using once. But I don't know. We'll see when I get in the shower. But this is for sure for the summer. And I had to get the vanilla um, foaming gel wash. I kind of want to open it right now because I'm not ready to use it. But um, I will definitely update you guys. And let you know but I just had to get it because I am such a huge vanilla fan and I can't wait to use this with the body butter I don't have any more of the scrub but for sure I gotta go get it now because I need the whole shebang I also picked up the tree hut tropic glow firming body oil Ooh, okay it got a nice little shine to it it smells good Okay, so you got, girl, not me trying to compare my dry hand with the, how, how I'm going to do that? But you can see, you can't see nothing. Like, what am I doing? But anyways, it's very moisturizing. I mean, it's an oil, so, but yeah, I can't wait to use that. And then the last thing that I picked up from Tree Cut, I believe, is um, this pink hibiscus. I, I, I can't stand that word because I feel like I'm not saying it right. <laughs> This is the body lotion. Ooh, uh, that smells good. Like, it's a really soft, fruity scent. It's very soft. Okay. I can definitely dig this. I can see myself whipping this out for the spring. Definitely summer. This can be layered with some really nice perfume. It's like a really nice, soft, floral kind of scent. So, um, yeah. I'm glad I picked that up. So I picked up this Good Molecules <laughs> Discoloration correct Correcting Serum. I can't talk, okay? Uh, but yeah, I picked this up because I was watching this young lady's video. I can't remember her name. She was talking about this and she said she really liked it. <clears throat> and I saw that it was affordable. I think it was like $12. Looking for something for... Um, like you know to have like a even skin tone i was gonna buy something from l'oreal um but this was cheaper okay so this is a nice size and yeah i'm i can't wait to see what it does let me know if you have tried anything from this brand um, let me know if you guys like this or not but i've been looking for something to you know even out the skin tone you know just trying to amp up my skincare because i've been doing really really well with um, staying consistent with my skincare products. I also picked up the Morphe 2 Sun and Done Smooth Gliding Bronzer Stick. And this is in Cocoa Coast. And they don't have a lot of colors. This is the darkest shade. And they probably should make some in-between shades. But this to, on me would be most likely a contour shade. I did see this in the store. But I didn't get it because I already purchased it online. Oh, it's really nice and creamy. Okay, yeah, that's definitely a contour shade on me. They don't have a lot of shades in this hair line, so maybe they expand a little bit more. 
This is the Bare Minerals Bare Pro 24-Hour Wear Skin Perfecting Matte Liquid Foundation. So when I seen matte, I was like, you know what, let me go ahead and try this out. I got the color Deep 51 Warm. Really like the packaging. I like that it's matte. So we're definitely going to be trying this out in a video. Let me know if you purchased this or um, if you were thinking about purchasing it. But I am going to try it on. It looks like it's going to work. So it came with a free brush as well. So if you purchase the foundation, you get a brush. So um, I don't, I mean, it came, that's, just, that's just what came with my order, okay? <laughs> so let me just take it out. That's what it looked like. Just a short brush. So we're, we're going to try all of that out. So let's get into what I got when I went inside the store. I had the nerve to buy some press-on nails. Knowing doggone well, I didn't need any more. And I feel like I had this pack before or I have it already. But either way it go, they were looking so, so pretty to me. And so then I also got these right here. I like these because these reminded me of my mom. She likes um, pearl nail polish like this this has like a pearl iridescent kind of vibe and it's kind of reminding me of my mom and I, uh, clearly i need to do my nails i'm excited about this i picked up the morphe bake and set setting powder in brightening pink and i know the pink powder has been very popular lately or at least last year let me know if you guys tried the pink powder from Morphe and if you like it and I need to see what the purpose is I really bought this because people were raving about it and a lot of you know darker skinned women say it worked for them so I was like well not this here brand in particular but just the pink powder in general but um let me know uh what what is it like what, what does it do I'm excited to try this out <sighs> I am upset. I did not read. I, I grabbed the wrong thing. This is the Elf Hydrating Camo Concealer in Deep Chestnut. I like the mattifying version. Damn. I mean, I have my receipt here. I could go exchange it, but do I want to do that? Also grab the Essence Lash Princess. Love this mascara. I think this is the color that I like. So I got another Tree Hut <laughs> item. I picked up the Tree Hut Coco Colada um, Moisturizing Body Lotion. And I picked that up because once again, you know, I was thinking about summer. This was kind of like giving me vacation vibes. Um, I haven't tried this scent yet. So, and I kind of like coconut scented things. Yeah. Oh yeah. Picked up a lip liner from About Face. I picked up the Matte Fix Lip Pencil. Um, girl, I don't know what color. Oh, the color is called Smoke. And this is just a brown lip liner, but I don't know if this is the one that I wanted. I thought they had like a deep one that's darker than this. That's darker than this here color. But yeah, that's what it looks like. I picked up two lip colors from LA Girl. And I don't know if these are new or not, this is their Lumi Luscious Luminous um, Lip Gloss. And I got the color Glow Up. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. I thought it was going to be like a... Oh, it's very like a unicorn iridescent kind of vibe. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, this one is called Champagne. And this one is called Glow Up. So glow up is like look like a, a sheer kind of like lavender color. So this one is glow up right here. So they both kind of they're different and the camera looks the same. This would be cute for like a girl or something if you have like a teenager. Just something like a little pop on the lip. I have two more items from LA Girl. These are new. I've seen these online and I wanted to check them out. So um, this one here, let's start with this one first. This is the LA Girl Rosy Glow Envy Bouncy Blush. And this is in the color Rosy Glow. And this is like that pink color. Now I hope I can get away with this um, here color. Oh, it's moosey for real. Oh no. Oh, that's ashy. Oh, baby girl. 
This will have to be an eyeshadow or something. The camera is definitely making it lighter <laughs> than what it is, but I'm not going to even play with I was going to put it on. I'm not going to do that right now. Um, but, um, ash it may be. <laughs> so once you like rub it in, it does turn to a matte formula. So a little does go a long way. Now, I wouldn't mind this formula. I wish they had more colors because I think this is the only color they had. If they come out with some more colors, I definitely wouldn't mind. I do really like the packaging, but that's ashy. So the highlighter, this one is called LA Girl Natural Glow Envy Bouncy Highlighter. And this is in the color Natural Glow. Now, I don't have on any highlighter today. So we can go ahead and try this on. I do want to feel it. Okay. It don't feel as bouncy as that blush. I kind of like this. I actually kind of like this. It's very, it's like a subtle, soft, it says natural glow. So I, I see it. I think I'm going to like that. That's very soft. Okay. So let's try that on because I'm, I'm excited. Mm. I can't really use my right hand on the left side of my face, so it hurts. <laughs> so I've been trying to maneuver with my left hand and I, I just, I feel slow. So I'm gonna try my best. It's pretty. what you all think? It's, ooh. Let's put some up here. I like that. And it's really nice. It definitely gave like a really nice natural glow. I like that. Okay, LA girl. Mm -hmm. So I picked up the NYX Duck Plump Lip Gloss. I don't know why I was not paying attention. So when I seen it in the store, I was like, oh, this is this is a cute lip oil. Clearly, it's, it looked like a lip gloss. I don't know why I thought it was a lip oil. I get home, and I'm like, wait, these are lip glosses, and I'm upset because they were fully stocked, and I could have purchased more than one shade. Um, I got the shade um, Bangin' Bear, and it's just a pretty nude, and I just thought these were lip oils. I just really wasn't paying attention to these when they came out. Ooh. Oh man, I want some more. Okay, last but not least, I got another foundation. Look at me. I wanted to try this out because I like the few items that I got from About Face. And I want to try more of their stuff. And I wanted to try their foundation. Yeah, this is their, what is this? The Performer Skin Focus Foundation. I got the color D1 Neutral. I felt like this one would suit me better. They were fully stocked in the store. And I just love the packaging. Now, I don't even know if this is mattifying or what. But we're going to figure it out, honey. Yeah. But, yeah, I got that. I'm so excited. I've seen a few people. Um, well, i just seen one. I think two people try this. So, um, I don't think a lot of people is talking about it. But, yeah. And I like the packaging. I like that they um, stay true to their packaging, which is pretty cool. So that's all that I got from Ulta, you guys. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification so you guys can be notified when I upload a video and comment down below and like this video if you have any of these products. And I will talk to you guys in another video. Bye.